Now the history of this, this castle goes back to the 25 centuries ago. Mm. All right, we're talking about 900, 850 BC. Mm. Wow. This castle was, or the name of Karak, was mentioned <coughs> in the Bible, in the Old Testament. Mm. It's mentioned Karak Castle being attacked by the king of Israel mm. with his allies, the kings of Edom and Judah. Or Judah, you know Judah, the kingdom of Judah? Yes. Yeah. Okay, in that direction, the west, in Palestine or Israel. And the kingdom of Edom, do you know where's the kingdom of Edom? Yes. North. South of Jordan, Betra mm -hmm. and Akaba. Mm -hmm. We are in the Moabite kingdom. So this was right. called Kir Moab in the Old Testament. Mm -hmm. Kir Moab. Mm -hmm. You remember on the map was called uh, Karak Muba yes. later on. Yeah. So different names being called this castle. Kir, Kir Haris, Kir Moab, and nowadays Karak. What does Karak mean? Krak. What does it mean? Krak. Krak is the big wall city. Wall city. Then came the, the, the Romans, always they used the castle. The, the, the Byzantine, the Christian, they used the castle. And then the Muslim, they used the castle. But the most important time is the Crusaders' time. All right? We are talking about the 11th century when they came. Very important to me to clear for you to tell you what the reasons of the Crusaders' war. First of all, at that time, what was going on in Europe? It was division, the church was divided, the East, the West Church. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So they thought the Crusaders' war will be united them. The second thing, there were many economical problems, as you mentioned, Yeshua, and they, 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 they needed a new places. Mm -hmm. And always the Middle East is a source for income. Mm -hmm. Like nowadays, it's oil. Yeah. Let's be frank, huh? Mm -hmm. yeah. It's oil. Long time ago, it's trading routes, mm -hmm. center, and also, as David said, protecting the holy places. You can make a lot of money if you control the, 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 the holy place, like this castle was, they were taking taxes from the caravans, right? Using the king's highway, mm. the Muslim from Damascus to, to Egypt, from Syria. Oh. So they make money, taxes. Mm -hmm. Also, a very important issue, at that time, most of the knights were second sons, you know that? Mm -hmm. They couldn't inherit anything in Europe. So they have to come to this area, mm. they have to establish their own kingdom. All right. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah, yeah. most of them, that. they were second son. Second son. And last reason at that time, the threat of the Muslims at that time. Mm -hmm. Muslims were threatening mm -hmm. because before that, mm -hmm. we had the Umayyad. You know the Umayyad, the, 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 the Moors, the Moors you call them? Yes. They, they reached Spain and Swiss and yeah. France. Mm -hmm. They surrounded Swiss for a while. Mm -hmm. So another reason <coughs> that the threat of the Muslims, okay. they were yeah, in Turkey, they were threatening to attack Europe. And also there were many wars in Europe, so they thought this campaign that we just mentioned by David, they were united, the, 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 the Crusaders of Europe, and they were able to make them go in one direction. For that they, they arranged the campaign to this area. We are at the Castle Karak, and it looks familiar it's because you've seen it in the movie Kingdom of Heaven. This place is pretty cool. You see the bottom stone right here, that's Mamluk stone, and if you go up, that's where the Crusaders built on, and as you can see over here, that's a lot of restoration going on in this yeah. Pretty interesting place. This is the area where the knights would sleep. If you look down there, this is uh, like oven over yeah. there. Can you see the oven? Yeah. Here's the okay, kitchen okay. area. Another one here. Another one behind David. Look behind David. You can see the chimney, but it's covered with sand. You see it? Yeah. This over here is a pit. We would have olives in there and squish and make the olive oil. Could you imagine trying to attack this castle with how steep this is? Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Guys, be careful. Be a Now we're down in the dungeon area, which actually is not too bad. If you look inside here, here's one of the rooms where they kept people in. They got a window, which was nice. Which, I, I'm not saying I would want to live in here, but at least they had a window they could look outside and in complete darkness the whole time. During the Ottoman times, this is where they would hang people. Stuff oh, over there. They would just drop. Is there live dust flying around? I don't know about. Very bad, yeah? Actually, we're standing on all the dead bodies that have rotted. And they just Josh, that's gross. 